Hi everyone, this is Who Gets the Glory, and today we're reading Walking with God for September 9th. The title is Holy Harvest. Do not be deceived, God is not mocked. For whatever a man sows, that he will also reap. Galatians 6, 7 Have you ever heard of a farmer who planted corn yet harvested wheat? Or have you seen tomato seeds grow into watermelons? Few things in life are as certain as the agricultural principle that whatever seed you plant, that's what you'll reap. The same is true in technology, garbage in, garbage out. And in finance, if you don't invest, you won't get a return. The same, of course, is true in the spiritual life. Through the books we read, the company we keep, the movies we watch, and the music we listen to, we are sowing either to the spirit or to the flesh. When we sow to the Spirit, we set our affections on things above, seeking first God's kingdom and His righteousness. By praying, studying God's word, sharing our faith, and bearing one another's burdens, we sow to the Spirit. But if we sow our lives and money to the flesh, according to the Apostle Paul, we reap corruption. Holiness is a harvest gained by careful sowing. Will you reap the reward of holy sowing? Or will you be surprised by what your harvest yields? Why would we want fame when God promises us glory? Why would we be seeking the wealth of the world when the wealth of heaven is ours? Why would we run for a crown that will perish with time when we're called to win a crown that is imperishable? Paul Washer Thank you for listening, and God bless you.